going? So today we're going to review Ryobi Caulk Gun P310G. But anyways, back to this caulk gun. I'll go ahead and show you what I'm doing. Psst. Get out of here. All right, so I'm just gonna, gonna, gonna kind of show you guys, you know, how much it'll do at its max output. So right here, I'm gonna go ahead and put in just a bead of caulk right here for this uh, base plate. Anyways, here we go. Take a look. As you can see, it's actually quite a bit. Um, it's really cranking it out. And one thing to know about this is that, you know, it'll actually run out pretty quick on its max setting. So if you're doing something like this, you know, you gotta have, you gotta have um, quite a few of these, uh, quite a few of these uh, tubes right here. This is just a 10 ounce. If you're doing uh, like multiple, multiple base plates and you're gonna need a bunch of those, but that just shows you how much is doing on this max setting. I, I gotta do another section right there. Yeah, and so like I was saying, uh, before the air compressor kicked on, so this is the highest setting right here. Let's see, it looks like, we'll call it, we'll call it five. And it actually sticks out a pretty good uh, amount of a caulk there. I mean, if you have a 10 ounce tube like this, I mean, you're gonna run out in 20, 20, 30 seconds. So if you're doing something like this, you know, it's gonna take a bunch. I'm probably using three fourths of a tube per eight foot of a uh, base plate. So one, two, three, four, you know, you just, you know, do the math. So we'll go ahead and do this right here. Again, hopefully we'll run out. We'll start at this end, work our way backwards. As you can see, it actually puts out a pretty good amount. We're gonna zigzag, yeah, there you go. There you go, so load it up with another tube here. Takes a second to come on out, but you know, once it does, it uh, comes out, like I said, a pretty good amount. We can zigzag it right here. We'll go a little bit slower to really get enough on there. One thing I like about this is that when you let off the trigger, it basically stops. I mean, there's very little, if any, that comes out. You know what I mean? So, so here's just uh, what it looks like from the top. Um, I'm going to put this board down here. 